Wasn't that cool? Hey, it's Ricky from Circus Arts Conservatory. Today I want to teach you a science trick that seems like a magic trick. We'll learn how to make a ball levitate using some household items. The supplies you will need are a jar or a cup with a bottom of about four inches, a pencil, a piece of paper, scissors, a bendy straw. You do definitely need your straw to be able to bend. A ping pong ball. If you don't have a ping pong ball, you can also use a rolled up piece of aluminum foil and scotch tape. The first thing you're going to do is put your glass jar on top of your piece of paper and draw a circle around the bottom of it. Next, we'll cut that circle out with scissors. You do want to make sure that you're using a jar that is 4 inches or larger on the bottom so that you are able to make the right size funnel for this. Jars that are less than 4 inches, the funnel is just too small. Next, we're going to put a dot at the center of our circle and a line going out to the outside of our circle. And we'll cut down that line with our scissors. Now we'll form our funnel. We'll tape it shut, making sure that we leave a little bit of room for our straw. You want to try and put the straw right in the middle. We're putting this on the top of the bendy end. Next, we'll tape it to the straw. Taping it to the straw as good as we can because we don't want any air to escape. So we'll put some tape on the inside and some tape on the outside. Once you've done this, it's a good idea to blow through it to check if you have any air that escapes from the sides. We only want air coming through the straw. If this happens to you, you might need to even it up a little bit. So was that magic or was it science? Well, all magic is based on science, so let's talk about the science behind this. As we know, a force is a push or a pull. My breath is the force pushing the ball up into the air. What force brings it back down? That's right, gravity. Gravity is the force that pulls all things towards the earth. Next, let's talk about kinetic and potential energy. Kinetic energy is the energy of movement. Potential energy is stored up energy. Where did you see kinetic energy? And where did you see potential energy? Kinetic energy is when the ball is moving up above the funnel, when it's hovering. Potential energy is right now, when the ball is sitting in the funnel, ready to maybe fall off or be pushed up to amaze your friends. Thanks for joining us. We hope you enjoyed it. Amaze your friends with this cool science trick.